How to start a rabbit farming business This video is designed and made to help you know how to start a rabbit farming business. And at the end of this video, you will find a valuable gift. It is a quality business plan template that you can download and modify to prepare a professional business plan for your rabbit farming business. If you are new to this channel, make sure you hit on the subscribe button for more rabbit teaching videos like this. Rabbits are not only cute and rabbits are not just for pets. They can also be a great source of income. So without wasting much time, let's dive into the world of rabbit farming and explore how you can get started. Before we begin, let's understand why rabbit farming is a lucrative business opportunity. Rabbits have a high productive rate. They mature quickly and require less space compared to other livestock. And also, rabbit meat is in high demand due to its nutritional value and low fat content. So let's jump into the first step of starting your rabbit farming business. Number one, research and planning. The first step in research and planning, it is crucial and important to gather information about rabbit breeds, their housing requirements, feeding habits, and market demand. Visit rabbit farms, read books, watch videos, and connect with experienced rabbit farmers to get more insight to the rabbit farming industry. Once you have a solid understanding, it's time to create a comprehensive business plan. A well thought out business plan will be your number one road to success. Outline your goals, target markets, marketing strategies, financial projections, and other operational details. Determine the number of rabbits to start with and calculate the initial investment. Make sure to include veterinary care, feed cost, and equipment expenses. Number two, setting up housing. The next step is setting up a suitable housing for your rabbit. Construct a building that provides sufficient space, ventilation, and protects the rabbit from predators. Each mature rabbit should have its own cage or hutch but the little bunnies can stay together, allowing them to move comfortably. Ensure proper hygiene to prevent disease. Also, consider a separate area for their breeding and nesting. Number three, choosing the right breeds. Now, this is an important part, choosing the right breeds of rabbits for your farm. Different breeds of rabbits serve different purposes, such as meat, fur, and pets. If you are going into rabbit farming for meat, you should consider the popular meat rabbits, which are the New Zealand White, California White, and the Chinchillas. If you are going into rabbit farming for fur production or hair, you should consider the Angoras. And if you are going into rabbit farming, for pet reasons then you should consider getting a dutch rabbit because they are said to make great pets conduct market research to understand the demand for specific rabbit breeds in your area and select accordingly number three feeding and care feeding and care plays a vital role in the overall health productivity of a rabbit ensure a balanced diet consisting of hay fresh vegetables and rabbit pellet or formulated feed clean drinking water should be available in all times regularly check for signs of illness so as to know when to give adequate medication or when to take to the veterinary officer number four breeding and reproduction breeding and reproduction are essential aspects of a successful rabbit farming business introduce a doe female rabbit to a buck male rabbit for mating at the appropriate age gestation period varies among most breeds 
but in average it takes 31 days provide private nesting for the doe female rabbit to give birth and nurse her kids number five marketing and selling once your rabbits are mature it's time to market and sell your rabbit explore local markets restaurants pet shop and even online platforms to find potential buyers advertise the quality of your meat for or pet rabbit to attract the right customers consider participating in agricultural fair events to showcase your farm and network with other farmers scaling and diversifying as your rabbit business grows you may consider scaling up and diversifying your operations this may include expanding your facilities increasing the numbers of breeding stock or exploring value added products such as rabbit manure rabbit urine and rabbit fur. conclusion starting a rabbit farming business can be fulfilling and profitable venture remember to conduct proper research and provide proper care to your rabbits with dedication your rabbit farm can be a successful business thanks for watching this video click on the subscribe button so that you get subscribed and join the family so anytime we post any video related to farming business or rabbit farming as a whole you'll get notified